So you may have seen a study recently saying that there are over 400 chemicals, I think, in plastics and PFAs that leach into our food, then they get into our body, they're found in our urine, and they must be a cause of breast cancer, making you panic. Stop panicking. I'm going to do a long video going into detail on this in the new year, but for now, the studies that show this were done on cells in a dish in a laboratory and mice studies. They are not done in humans. Plastics have one of the lowest grades of carcinogens. They are a grade 2A, meaning they might possibly, probably are linked to cancer. It is not a definite, like alcohol, which definitely causes cancer. They scare you by saying the chemicals in plastic, like PFAs, act as endocrine disruptors. A very scary word, meaning they can affect our estrogen metabolism by um, a ta a targeting to estrogen receptors. It's scary. However, Think of all the foods you eat that have natural phytoestrogens, all the fruits, coffee, cereals, the phytoestrogens are good for us. Now, they are also endocrine disruptors and they influence our hormonal metabolism. And actually they can prevent you getting breast cancer because with these additional estrogens attaching to the estrogen receptors, it lowers the natural levels of estrogen in our blood. So the phytoestrogens in soy, which is good for us as a food stuff, work just the same way as the chemicals in the plastics do. They are both endocrine disruptors, potentially affecting our hormonal balance. But the effect they have is very, 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 very small. And if you are so concerned about getting cancer from plastics, you better damn well be exercising five times a week and cutting down alcohol and eating a diet based on vegetables because they can reduce your risk of cancer by 20%. And that is proven on human studies. So cut down on plastics by all means if you were doing it for the environment or you don't like the taste, but you do not need to worry that plastics cause breast cancer. And I go to the CRUK website, which says this, there is no evidence that plastics cause cancer. They are highly regulated. Please stop panicking and watch out for my feed in the new year. We'll do a longer video going into all of this in detail.